Bro. Sometimes public places suck. Because a place is public, that means everyone can go there. Um, orange guy, that's literally the definition of public. Of course anyone can go there. Yeah, bro, you're right. Anyone can go there. Anyone and everyone. That means that you'll find booty scratchers on the train, people who eat their ice cream with their hands at the ice cream shop, and super loud people at the movies. Bro, what the freak are you laughing at? The movie hasn't even started. You guys don't find this completely blank screen hilarious? Yo! What's up, guys? It's your boy, Orange Guy Animations. And man, you can find some weirdos out in the wild. So let me tell you about one of the goofballs that I found. So if you don't already know, I'm a huge Sonic fan. Sonic is my boy. We even share the same birthday. So you already know, when a new Sonic thing comes out, I gotta support the gang. At the time, the second Sonic movie was coming out, and I was gonna go see it. With my mom. We were gonna go see the new Sonic movie. So we pull up to the movie theater, and as I'm looking around, I noticed there was a bunch of little kids. But hey, that makes sense, because Sonic was made for the youngsters. But I did notice, this super sweaty guy in the corner, bro was a picture perfect discord mod and looked super suspicious. But hey man, as long as he's here for Sonic and not the kids, oh. then we Grouchy. Grouch, grouch. So we went inside and grabbed our seats and we got there so early, nothing was even playing yet. Oh my God. So we decided to just chill. Well, since I'm here, might as well check my YouTube analytics. <gasps> it says only 30% of you guys are subscribed. <laughs> That's not good. It seems like now would be a great time to subscribe. Might as well like the video while you're at it. Go ahead. I'll wait. So after a while of just chilling in the theater by ourselves, it filled up a bit, and they started playing some ads. There was this ad for Nintendo, and I was like, oh hey, Nintendo, I like those guys. <laughs> Man, I can't wait to get that game. Are you serious, my brother? Bro, why the freak was this guy screaming in the movie theaters? And why was he sharing his opinion? Literally nobody asked. With his big mouth self. Oh! And this guy didn't even stop being loud because he would laugh at the dumbest things ever. It would be something like, well, if it isn't Dr. Eggman, or should I say, Baldy McNose hair. <laughs> this dude was laughing like this. The entire time! Bro, the movie wasn't even that funny. It was literally all Baldy McNose hair type jokes. But this man, this man could not contain himself. Luckily at the movie theaters, it's super loud. There was only a couple times where I was like, this guy needs to shut up. But it would have been nice if we could have eliminated him. Moral of the story, it's actually okay to laugh at the movie theaters. If something's funny, it should make you laugh, bro. Now yelling at an ad is actually crazy, bro. Don't go and do that. You gonna get popped. And with that being said, I'll catch you in the next video. Yo, what's up guys? And cards or guy. Yes sir, yes sir. 
hey, okay, that's what I wanted to say. Um, if I made a Discord, like, server, would you guys join that? Like, would you guys be, like, part of the gang? What, what would we even do, bro? Like, you guys want to, like, play Smash Bros or something? I don't know. I was thinking of doing that because, you know, we're reaching, like, a thousand subscribers soon. So, you know, a Discord would be, like, cool or something. I don't know. But, yeah, let me know in the comments which you would, uh, if you would join or something. Or you want to become the Discord mod. <laughs> Sweaty. <laughs> Okay, um, yes, also subscribe, like I said earlier, I do still have the strap on me. I will blast you if you don't subscribe!